Need to program your lathe subspindle? With SmartCam, you can. SmartCam version 18.5 provides new functionality to generate toolpath and CNC code for turning centers with main and subspindles. Here's a fast overview of how SmartCam is used to program machines with this configuration. Previous releases of SmartCam included a set of default work planes for the primary orthogonal machining planes on a single spindle. The set of default axes have been extended to provide primary planes configured for use on the subspindle. Here is the complete set of default work planes. Users can easily switch between work planes on either spindle. All turning and milling operations can now be defined on either the main spindle or the subspindle. We'll show you how easily this is done with a simple facing example. First, we will select the turning plane on the main spindle and generate a facing process. We verify with show path toolpath verification. Now we will face the component in the subspindle. We simply select the subspindle ZX work plane and program our facing operation. Again, we verify with show path. Work planes can also be selected by picking a solid, geometry, or toolpath element that is already on the target work plane. A right-click pop-up menu can be used to manage SmartCam work planes. The offset distance between the main and subspindles is set up using this dialog panel. Our example uses a distance of 3 inches. SmartCam can now display the subspindle datum in addition to the world datum on the main spindle. The axes configuration in SmartCam means that positive Z is always in the direction away from the workpiece, whichever spindle is being programmed. SmartCam's code generators can be configured to output high-quality, accurate CNC code, including correct spindle codes and cutting modes for subspindle work. SmartCam defaults to an opposed subspindle configuration, but users can define work planes for a subspindle located alongside the main spindle as required. New work planes are associated with a subspindle by using the On Subspindle option on our updated plane definition dialog panel. And there's a whole lot more. SmartCam version 18.5 includes significantly improved support for machines that have B and C rotary indexable axes. We'll conclude our demonstration by taking a look at an example that includes hole making and milling operations using B and C axes indexing, in addition to turning processes. You will find more information on our enhanced rotary axis programming functions in a separate video available on our website. For more information on SmartCam version 18, please check the SmartCam CNC website at smartcamcnc.com or call us at 541-344-4563. Need to program your lathe subspindle? With SmartCam, you can!